guys good afternoon and welcome back to the vlogs today we are going shopping i don't remember the last time i went shopping there is this point giving application thing that we had at our at the company and i received some points last year and i ordered basically you can order different kind of things for a certain amount of points and i placed my order last year and it just never came in so i contacted that vendor which vendor we're not working with anymore but I just contacted them you know like maybe they can resend the, these vouchers these coupons or however I should call them and they did resend them today I got five FedEx packages and I got the coupons so I'm so happy we are after work I got ready to be honest I'm not really in the mood to dress up or something like that but I just have some black jeans on you can't really see and I put this over over here i'm just gonna put on my vans get my tote back and go because i feel like it's still early and hopefully not that many people will be there i've been using this fragrance for quite a while now as you can see it's only up until here it's from bershka and it's called sweet peony or i don't know how it's pronounced but it's so nice it's such a little spring scent i would say i also purposely don't have anything on my face i did put a moisturizer this morning i was working from home today but i just don't want to put anything on my face now because my main goal today is to shop for skincare so we're gonna go to dm and see what they have i have my serums but there are a few things that i've been wanting to try out maybe we can look for some new makeup because i'm really low on like options for my lips my birthday is coming up next month so i want to go into different shops and see if they have cute tops or like a dress or whatnot i don't really want to throw a big birthday party i usually just reserve some tables at a bar or something like that and we're usually just out drinking talking catching up mainly with my friends from high school i had such a great class in high school and we're still keeping in touch so we will see what we find but before we go i had some time during the lunch break and you guys i tried out this new recipe and this is what she looks like i tried it out obviously just like a few minutes ago and this is basically ricotta and spinach filled or stuffed cannoli these are the cannolis right here and you drench it in this tomato paste or sauce or whatnot it looks amazing but what i've been doing lately is whenever i try out something new i just make a shorts a youtube shorts video about it so if you haven't seen it you can just go on my profile and click on shorts and all the shorts videos will be there so check it out if you want to apart from the fun shopping stuff i need to get some supplies for home as well usual everyday things we are gonna go out of toilet paper and tissue so i have to get that probably go to the bank as well because i just i need some cash the more time i live alone the more i realize i'm becoming my mom which is an amazing thing <laughs> let me tell you but she's the one who used to have all these lists written down not on her phone whatsoever she is old school okay so here we have to wait i need my other hand as well okay i know i'm already dressed up but i wanted to try this out so we have these drinks from absolute live it says that they are professional <laughs> one of them is uh, pineapple flavored and the other one is grapefruit cocoa flavored and they're supposed to be like fat burner drinks <sighs> so many thoughts about this i'm not specifically like really trying to burn fat i'm just trying to get a little bit more toned let's just try it Ooh, grapefruit and cocoa flavor guys this tastes like a coconut water this is so good again i don't know if this does anything it says that it has zero sugar okay that felt great actually gonna pop it in the fridge and we're gonna get going i 
think this is gonna be the most fun haul I've ever done. I've never spent this much money at the end and I'm out of breath. I ended up not going to the bank. I think I'm just gonna go tomorrow. Tomorrow's gonna be an office day. Okay, let's start. We've got a huge bag. Oh my gosh. I am so grateful because there are quite a few stuff which I only got because I got these vouchers. Otherwise, I wouldn't, like it wouldn't have justified it because some of them were quite expensive. Okay, I feel like this is a little bit better lighting. So I tried out these protein bars. As I said, I think at the beginning of the video that I'm trying to be a little bit more mindful and try to eat good as an addition to working out because one does not work without the other. My boyfriend just told me that there is this like nine, so, so, what was it? Like 80 to 20? Uh, ratio like if you want to change your looks and like get healthier or get toned or like change your physical appearance with workouts the workouts would be 20% and the other 80 would be what you eat so I'm trying to bring in more protein so I found these protein gums at DM guess they are supposed to be good for you and these are the protein bars that I started talking about um, I got these two new ones, which have um, like 50% of them is protein. They look like this. They look like like cookie fra flavored, oh, it's stracciatella flavored, which is great. I like that. So I got three of these. And these are the protein bars I started talking about. This is what they look like. It's 21% protein and 27% oat flakes. And it says that it's good for after working out other food kind of related thing that i got is this honey ginger instant tea now if you saw the london vlogs you know that i got these ones or like similar ones not the one with the honey but without the honey um as a recommendation from my dad my dad recommended to me when we went to dm i think it was a week before flying to london and we were looking for these with honey but they didn't have that and those ones, the without honey and without anything, those are super duper strong, I have to say. And then I purchased these ones and uh, the honey helps definitely. So I usually just drink these uh, at night before going to bed. If I am reading at night, it's really nice. I just like to have uh, some kind of a tea, like a calming tea or a healthy tea with me. I keep referring to the London vlog, I'm so sorry. But in London, I tried this kombucha. I was looking for kombucha. I had really bad cramps, but also my tummy just felt like a little bit funny. And they had this Captain Kombucha out there. I have to say, this is the exact one that I tried out there on, I think it was on the second day and it's in the vlogs as well. Um, and they do taste really, really delicious. This one is ginger and lemon, but I have found these which are like winter edition as it says down here and this one is apple and cinnamon so i'm excited these were super overpriced they were around a thousand forints for one bottle which is unjustifiable like i know that this is really great for your gut health um but um yeah there's one more thing I'm running low on a protein shake and I saw this. This was a fairly good price for 300 grams. This one is just a vanilla protein shake and it's also from DM's uh, sports brand, which is called Sportness. But yeah, it does have B, vitamin B6 and it also has vitamin B12, which is something that I don't eat much of. Vitamin B12, as far as I know, is mostly found in meat and and i think specifically red meat but i'm not sure so don't quote me on that please so this is just gonna be great for me all right this is everything kind of food related i got my favorite bath salt which looks like this such a good price it's around 500 forints and it lasts like i think more than a month i really haven't been having um many baths maybe i should they're just so calming and when i do i usually use this uh bath salt this one is 
oh, it's actually called bathing crystals, I'm sorry. Um, and these are lavender scented. There's also a different one, which is eucalyptus scented. I think that's also good for relaxing, but for me, lavender is just great. I also got some pads because it was necessary. I figured I should get a few things that I always need, like I'm always gonna need, and that was one of those. The boyfriend asked me to pick him up a few things, so I got him a deodorant. I personally don't like the Nivea brand, um, but this is what he asked for, so he gets what he wants. And I also got this shower gel for him. Something else that I actually needed is for the clothes. This is textile softener in the scent of cotton blossom. This is what it looks like. Today, I don't know how are you guys, but uh, I like to do my clothes in like in like one big batch. Like I would divide the whites, the blacks, and like the colorful clothing items and just do them one after another because I don't like the clothes like hanging around, drying in the middle of the apartment. And usually like most of the time we are at a home on the weekends. Oh wait, that's, okay, that's not true. I, I just don't like it, like seeing the clothes out there. I feel like it's just, it looks like clutter when I go into the room. All right, we arrived to makeup, but mostly skincare. I got two of these sheet masks, which are my favorite, and they are such good value for for the price that they are. These are the Balea Med Ultra Sensitive Touche Mask, which is not something that I can pronounce well, but uh, these are basically without any without any scent, and they are supposed to be good for all different kinds of. Um, skin types and they have really really good price I, I think these are the cheapest ones that you can get and they're like so fancy ones but um, anyways all right I got my first ever Neutrogena product I don't usually buy anything from Neutrogena I have a, as I said a really really dry skin not just on my face but all over my body and I actually have a little bit of a strawberry skin on like the top of my thighs and also here so i am there are two things at first i'm trying to drink a little bit more water and second i'm trying to use some kind of a moisturizer after getting out of the shower every night or when i shower in the morning then in the morning to be honest i'm not really good with that i'm trying to get better uh, but getting new products it just always motivates me it just smells like fresh really really fresh so yeah intense repair body lotion that is what i need i'm definitely gonna try this out this evening okay next thing i got is this relax aeromax uh, massage oil the one thing about my boyfriend is that he really likes to get massages he usually goes i think twice a month or something like that his back usually hurts a lot and also around um, his waist. He just suffers with the actual pain there. And um, as much as I like that he, he, he goes there and he gets it done, I'm trying to help him however I can. I'm not a great masseuse. Um, a lot of the times I don't know what I'm doing, but I figured it would be great to have a massage oil at home, just handy because sometimes he does ask me like, can you do like a little massage up here or like on his back and i'm trying to do my best um i'm not really good at it but with these massage oils i feel like it's a lot lot easier getting back to the gym talk um i forgot to take my deodorant the other day and it was really bad but also not that much at the same time i feel like it just bothered me because i i don't i mean i sweat but i don't really smell that much this is so tmi but i don't really smell that bad and usually what i do is i put on usually i went twice but you know what i mean i put on my gym clothes i go there i get the workout done i put my pullover back my coat back i change my shoes and then i come right back home and then i got a shower at home um so it wasn't really like smellable i just didn't like it didn't feel like comfortable if you know what i mean so i wanted to get another 
uh, deodorant just for um, my gym bag so I have one at home and I have one in the bag and I saw this and it looked so so cute with a little bunny on the half moon this is like a limited edition thing it says reach for the stars and they have this scent um, which is called make a wish um, in all different kinds of products. And I'm really happy about this purchase. If you guys go to DM, you probably know that they have um, this brand, their own brand, Alverde, which is uh, basically a natural cosmetics line. So I got this um, hyaluronic hydro face mist kind of thing. I figured if I used it after doing my makeup, I think I would rather use a fixing spray but maybe I could use it before so it just gets my face a little bit moisturized mm, it smells really good got a fixing spray because I ran out of it uh, from Trend It Up but this is also a name brand from uh, DM uh, please uh, so this one is the Trended Up Perfect Last uh, Multifunctional Fixing Spray. Also from Trended Up, I got this Matcha Awake Primer. It looks like this. I think the bottle is so cute. I just love playing around with all these products. I don't know about you guys, but these things just make me so happy. And it's also really nice if you try out new products and you find that something is actually working for you and you see the difference on your face and it can really, really boost your confidence. I've never really used primer before. I don't know, but if someone is really good at makeup and is watching this video, please let me know. Like, is it essential? Do I really have to use a primer? Is it a scam? What's the deal? Because this looks cute. It feels great on my face. Um, let me know. I only got one item which I feel like counts as makeup. I bought one of these, I think it was two years ago and I still have a little bit of it, which is the Essence What The Fake Plumping Lip Filler, which uh, this one is with cinnamon oil. The other one that I had was with cayenne or something really really spicy so as it says in the name if you put it on it's supposed to be plumping your lips oh, and this one is so cute and this one is in a pearly nude finish and this one is vegan which is something that we love let's see oh it's definitely tingly a little bit not as much as the the other one i don't know what do you guys think the lighting is not the best i know i'm sorry because it's the evening three more things that we have i feel like these are the main ones for valentine's day i did a package for my boyfriend that was the first time that i tried out um this brand which is called revox i did a little bit of a digging and i've been wanting to get some kind of a healing solution which is uh chemical peeling and not like physical peeling so i figured i would get this aha acid and this one is a 30 percent serum i hope i got the right percentage a first time trying out pom pom which is so cute it's also natural skincare i'm so sorry so i just uh, need to scratch my so this one is also natural skincare if i can i will always levitate towards um, the natural ones this was definitely a little bit more pricey i think it was around three or four thousand and this one is a pore tightening um serum or gel and it's supposed to be as it says in the name tightening your pores Oh, this is really nice. Face gel, normalizing intensive moisturizer for acne prone skin with large pores. Yeah, well, I would say that my skin on my face is not like 100% acne prone, but I do have my periods of acne, especially when it's that time of the month. 
and this is what it looks like so cute okay you guys the last thing that i got is this beauty expert night cream which is with retinol um this one is from balea and i do have retinol serum at home and i am using it rigorously and it's really really helping me i would say i love that this product is vegan as well i've never tried anything from balea which is this beauty expert i'm gonna try this out tonight and this one is also in like a pumping smells really natural and nice that is it you guys that's the big haul i again i am so grateful that i got these vouchers and i am so sad because this was the last time that i could use these vouchers because as i said we don't work with this vendor anymore but that's okay i'm so happy that they sent me these these coupons or vouchers or whatnot and that i could spend on all these fun things and also things which i actually needed but that is it you guys that's all that we have out here on the counter thank you so much for watching i really hope that you guys enjoyed and if you did enjoy don't forget to like this video and also subscribe for more content and yeah definitely let me know what kind of videos you would like to see on my channel i just really like interacting with you guys um in the comments down below so start the talk i'll be there and answer you guys always thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys the next time bye guys